I wonder if you know about Mr. Putin's train. After the outbreak of the, um, well, after he started the Ukraine war, uh, he started to use an armoured train uh, to get from his own little residence into the Kremlin. And the train stops at its own station, some of which have been specially built for Mr. Putin. And it runs on a special schedule to make sure that it can run without stopping, without pause, without having to um, wait for other traffic. Well, of course, a little bit like Mr. Putin's um, uh, cars, which are this cavalcade of cars, um, uh, across Moscow, you know, if you're caught behind that, that's you for the re for the rest of the day. You 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 don't get to your meeting. Similarly, of course, with um, Patriarch Kirill, but now Mr. Putin joins the ranks of people like well, the Fuhrer. The Fuhrer. Um, Hitler had his own train, which was uh, ironically called America and the Brandenburg. At one point, uh, it it was also known as the Fuhrer headquarters. Of course, we have to point out that the Queen uh, was quite keen on her train, and Prince Charles, when he was Prince Charles before he became king, was also keen on the train. But I think the British royal train is not an armoured train. This is an armoured train to protect Mr. Putin from unwanted military uh, attack, I suppose. We wouldn't want that, would we? Well, congratulations on, on, um, uh, on, on developing an interest in rail enthusiasm, Mr. Putin.